international doctors has been describing horrific scene at the Shifa hospital where 300 bodies were found. Some were tied up and executed, including doctors, women, and children. Is the White House calling for an independent investigation? Uh, so look, Hamas should not, uh, should not be operating out of hospitals. We have said that. We've said that over and over again. Uh, and putting civilians at risk. That's what we're seeing. And we are concerned by how Hamas appears. It, they appear to have been able to reconstitute in a hospital uh, so quickly. So we've always ma also made clear that we continue to support Israel's right to defend itself. But, but as we've also said, we do not want firefights uh, in a hospital where innocent people, uh, people, helpless people, people seeking medical care are caught in, in a crossfire. We don't want to see that. Uh, we have urged Israel to take every step to avoid civilian casualties. And this just points to how challenging Israel's military operation is because Hamas has intentionally embedded themselves into, into civilian infrastructure, into these hospitals. And so, uh, and so we've been very clear as, as it relates to the footage, as it relates to the photos and reportings, we have not verified that photo footage. We're, we're going to be reaching out uh, to the Israeli uh, government to get more information. But obviously, if these reports are true, that is indeed deeply concerning. The difference between the civilized world and uncivilized world is sticking to international law at the time of war. So. Regardless, even if these people were Hamas, do you believe that under international law, Israel has the right to execute people, even if Hamas, which you consider a terrorist organization, regardless, you can't hold them to the same standard as a professional army that often the White House prays as a professional army, they know what they're doing. And even sometimes you said, I wish the U.S. Army behaved like the Israelis. I hear your question, and I have said it is deeply concerning if it's true. We are reaching out to Israel uh, government to get more information. 